all made out of galvanized and uh, it doesn't look like much but this bed is actually in way nicer shape than the one we have so we're going to attempt to take it off there's not much good for this truck it's not worth rebuilding or anything like that it's pretty rough everywhere um, the hood's a really nice shape and it's got good hood, <coughs> good hood springs so we're going to take those off tonight and then uh, this is by far the best hood that we have here so we'll use it and Pretty much this truck is just a parts truck and it's it's rough. So we'll uh start. but the motor's unseized. Yeah, but the motor's unseized, I'm surprised. So we'll put another hood on it, just kind of cover it up. So I'm actually amazed. But yeah, let's I guess get to work here before the rain comes. Rust through the roof. Right, just uh, cutting the old uh, bolts out because they're rusted. There's no sense trying to take them out by hand. So they're not gonna come. No. <laughs> One down. Also a tech tip. The guy that invented the uh, cordless tool, Nobel Prize. They should name a country after it. Yeah, this one. You want me to try to hold it up first? Besides, it doesn't matter. These ones are all the ones in Kev Fox are way better anyway. Yeah. Well, yeah, they're really nice box I think, for a set. Yeah. Just the painted ones. Ooh, yeah, they're right here. Yeah, they're showing me off. Oh, oh no, there's like there's six. You lied to me, Chris. Because there's there, there's two, there's yeah. two, there's uh, right back here. Holy shit! Mm, close enough. <laughs> I figured bring a face shield, eh? Yeah. Yeah, I should, but just don't. Yeah, sure. The uh, box hey, bolts are like a, done. Yeah, now we're just like gonna like cut the uh, running board to the fender bolts, and the box can come off. Yeah, Casey says he'll uh, do a right drive out there. Hey, right, just pulling the hood off it. It's, it's a good hit hood, and we're gonna use this one. And the hinges seem good. Oh, there you go. And here's a little uh, automotive tech tip. If you need a uh, light under your old Ford, just bend up some uh, sheet metal, 
put a 12 volt bulb and a switch and you got a underhood lighting. Coming around. Oh, I'm just going over some farm equipment. I'm just more preparing for it. You're the big boy. Yep. I think it's easier sitting on the couch. Okay, Derek, get all the way there. Put it down. There you go. That's fine. Good job, Casey. If you like this video, please like and subscribe.